Hey guys, Nick Tian here, and uh, I'm playing um, Marvel's Avenger Alliance Tactics. It's a new Facebook game, so you know, if for the, for some people who don't want to play Facebook games, uh, anyways, it is uh, kind of like a sequel to Marvel Avengers Alliance, which is a turn-based uh, fighting not not to say fighting game, but a turn-based game, but. This is slightly a bit different, so I'll just show you guys what it is. So I'm ju I just started a mission, and I'm gonna be taking aim. So, for example, here is where the mission is. Uh, as you can see on this map, it's kind of like one of those. Uh, I don't know what you call them. Uh anyways, let, let's 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 just go for the missions first. Alright, so when you start a mission you can just select, you know, like say I want I want uh Black Panther and Iron Man on the team together with me, so with that. Uh before that I think I can Upgrade, train my Black Panther. So let's see. It will take three minutes. So let's not do this first. Uh, we'll do this later. So just want to launch the mission. Combat team incomplete. Uh, yeah, but I don't have that many heroes. So let's just launch with this. As you can see, typical of a Facebook game. Well, not say typical, but uh, there is a lot of waiting to be involved. This is just the second mission. Kind of the third mission, the first one was a tutorial, this is the third mission in the game and you're really like waiting to, to go to missions and that kind of thing. Okay, right now, uh, what's different from this compared to something like uh, Avenger Alliance is that you move around, you do have, uh, you know, the ability to move your characters around. So if you play games like uh, XCOM or things like that, it's not as complicated as those, but you know, or things like Final Fantasy Tactics, Ogre Tactics, and things like that. It's not as well. Why are they attacking each other? Oh, strengthening. Okay, but yeah, is I'm not sure whether or not it would ever reach that level of sophistication, but as a Facebook game, you know, I don't think I expect. Not to say that I don't expect much, but you know, at least it is something, I guess. So I just took out two guys. So the cool thing is like you don't only have like oh one to one damage attack, one to one attacks. You can you know do moves which are. Attacking multiple guys and Black Panther here was fast enough that you could have seen on the top here just now was <laughs> I'm sorry I'm still new to this showing off game and stuff so yeah so as you can see from here my Black Panther is you know maxed out on his level so meaning that I could go back to base and level up thankfully going back to base I don't have to you know wait for it but yeah so after every mission we get to claim you know like click here claim rewards and I got some rewards cool and now I'm going back to the base uh, what I wanted to say was that it was more towards something like uh, Clash of Clans I guess that's, that's a way of uh, explaining it Clash of Clans meaning that you get to choose you know you get to have your base and then you can attack somebody else's base so like for example I could attack this guy's base I think they're all shield as well so you can see like oh I could build up my base and then I go attack this guy or this guy and they could attack me so this shield here is probably a way to signify that you know what I I can't be attacked right now so instead of you know I'm not sure whether or not it would be turn base or it will be automatic but 
uh, okay we will see so first off i want to upgrade my black panther because his uh his he reached you know he reached level two so now i can train so like i was saying that you know it took about three minutes okay so i could you know immediately uh level up they gave his out for free so you know why as well so i got level up so i could go you know for the next level as well but that's not all uh you can equip you know uh equipment on your character so for example my shield i got this from a mission a random drop from a mission and you know i could equip it on iron man or not but you know you might as well do so right yeah so there and i'm guessing that as these are the moves that you have each character has four moves and then you have your iso here which if you're familiar with marvel avengers alliance you will have you will be equipping you know different isos that you find on a map you know like this iso 8 so think they would do things like increase your speed or accuracy evasion or health or attack that kind of thing and of course you know since this is still an alpha i'm i'm guessing that they don't have all the costumes and things like that you know which i prefer this one a little bit more because you know it's a 3d model it's not like uh avenger alliance which was a uh, 2d uh, art this is a 3d model so you can see, as you can see here you can get black widow captain america uh is this captain marvel i think it's captain marvel yes captain marvel cyclops Hawkeye, Doctor Doom, you know, if you've got the points to, to spend, you can get them. I don't know how you get more points for now. Let's see, gold. Is it gold? No, it's Avengers point, this one. I'm guessing, uh, oh, by completing assignments and receiving shield bonuses. So I'm not even sure that you can uh, pay for it for now, anyways. Uh, so shield protection here you know grants your base protection for enemy attack for limited time so i have 24 hours to build up my base and hopefully nobody attacks my base that kind of thing okay then on the left side here we have like assignments that we could do that we could get uh you know unlock stuff so for example this would be I'm guessing my rewards like this potential shield bonus I wonder if there's any more tasks to do uh, it's called menu management yeah so so it, it's kind of like the way that you it the task gives you like oh reasons to 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 play the game not say reasons to play the game but guide you along so for example oh this is the next mission that i should do okay so we're gonna do this mission and we're gonna fly off to the mission so launch so it takes 14 seconds so because i was training black panther i have to put him back into the team these guys are more for defense so i'm wondering if i can level them up so for, for example now that uh since i can't be attacked or anything so I might as well put uh, some of my shield agents there so that, you know, maybe they can level up. I don't know. So let's try it out. So again, you know, you have to wait around for a while. You know, 15 minutes, 14 seconds, I think I saw it. So just wait around. You can send them home straight away, I guess. They just attack. As usual with all these Facebook games, you can invite your friends. I'm guessing uh, you can attack them, that kind of thing. You know, uh, it, it's kind of the the way that you can have multiplayer. That instead of everyone being together, playing together, you can you know just have them attack each other. Alright. So 
is charging. But as you can see, like because this this guy is whoa, okay, he took the turn fast. But let's take out the aim guys first, okay? So let's see recovery time fast. Okay, let's just use this. As you can see on top here, it's kind of nice because you can see who is next, whose turn comes up next. So I can maybe attack this guy because his turn is next. So I will move Iron Man up and I will attack this guy, take him out. Oh, he dodged. Move my agent up. Take this guy out. All right. Well, the agent was actually quite effective. So next would be this guy, uh, Black Panther. I'll just send him up. Well, it's nice that you can move as much as you want within the, you know, the blue box. So it doesn't, it is not like, oh, you know what? You have to stop within this blue box. You can, you know, move anywhere you want, except after you've done an, done an action, which is like attack or things like that. Alright, Dizzy. Cool, so I get another attack. You know, I really want to have Iron Man actually, so I can just shoot them in one shot. Dizzy again. Oof. Stay. Alright, that's fine. And since right now this guy, is, I can't attack anyone at, at all, so I'll just end turn, which is like basically a guard. So Iron Man here, because they are all in a straight line, I can use this uni beam. I'm wondering if I will attack. Oh, there is friendly fire, but uh, that's fine. It's the end of the mission, anyways. B uh, the other reason is because I want to see if. They do heal after the battle, or I have to wait until, you know, uh, like a certain amount of time for them to heal. So I can claim reward right now. And, and this is where you get your equipment, you know, extra equipment or Avenger coins. So you can go back to the missions that you have and, and try to unlock some of these items if these missions have uh, those equipment at all so we can see that Black Panther was hurt just now so I just want to check to see you know the last thing I want to do right now uh, for, 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 for this uh, preview is just look at his health and whether or not he is recovered and I can't look at his health okay uh, I'm guessing once I go back his health will be full Unless I can see, look at the Queen Jets. Nope, I can't. So yeah, that's basically it. Uh, I'm sorry that I can't show you, you know, how... Oh yeah, the other thing is like, you can build... Uh, you know, build more areas on your base. So I had a training ground here. I could build a barracks, uh, refinery, vault, that kind of thing. So, you know, you can upgrade your area, then hopefully that they'll get stronger, you can re uh, improve your team so that when these guys attack, oh, I'm guessing I do, you know, send a whole team. But yeah, you know, it's like you can send a team to attack other players and things like that, which is kind of cool. You know, it's... And I'm guessing if you add friends, you can, you know, attack your friends as well. But uh, I think that's about it. You know, I'm. It's still an alpha, so I don't think every single, you know, there's energy here again. I don't think every single, you know, uh, option or, you know, uh, function is in yet. But, you know, if you get get to play it, I think it's quite fun, because. It is a bit different from uh, Avengers Alliance, which was just you click 
on a mission and then you attack each other and then that's it. This one is more tactical. You get to move your characters around. You know, recently I've been looking at uh, Hero Clicks and, and this is kind of like a, an online version of Hero Clicks, you know. So, yeah, it, it's for me, it's, it's something that I, I think is quite interesting. So I might continue playing it. I'm a bit worried about uh, how people can attack me and I might lose team members, but I'm not that sure yet. So I'll keep on playing. I'll keep on trying out. If there's anything, you know, different from that, I'll, I'll, I'll maybe I'll do another video. But for now, this is just a, you know, a quick glimpse at uh, Marvel's Avenger Alliance tactics. So just want to thank you guys for watching. You know, I'll be, I'll still be playing because, you know, I still have like 58 energy to go. But uh, f for now, I'll just end this uh, video. And I just thank you for watching. Uh, leave a like if you like it. Uh, subscribe to my channel to see more, you know, gaming videos. And, uh, you know, thank you for watching. See you guys next time. Bye.